ಎಲ್ಲರಿಗೂ ನಮಸ್ಕಾರ ಆನ್ ಫಸ್ಟ್ ಏಪ್ರಿಲ್ ಟೂ ತೌಸಂಡ್ ಸೆವೆಂಟೀನ್ ಸ್ಟೇಟ್ ಬ್ಯಾಂಕ್ ಆಫ್ ಮೈಸೂರ್ ಆಲ್ಸೋ ನೋನ್ ಆಸ್ ನಮ್ಮ ಬ್ಯಾಂಕ್ ಆರ್ ಮೈಸೂರ್ ಬ್ಯಾಂಕ್ ವಿಲ್ ಬಿಕಮ್ ಪಾರ್ಟ್ ಆಫ್ ದ ಸ್ಟೇಟ್ ಬ್ಯಾಂಕ್ ಆಫ್ ಇಂಡಿಯಾ ದಿಸ್ ಶಾರ್ಟ್ ಫಿಲ್ಮ್ ಈಸ್ ಅ ರೆಕಾರ್ಡ್ ಆಫ್ ದ ಗ್ಲೋರಿಯಸ್ ಹಿಸ್ಟ್ರಿ ಆಫ್ ದಿಸ್ ಬ್ಯಾಂಕ್ ಓವರ್ ದ ಲಾಸ್ಟ್ ಹಂಡ್ರೆಡ್ ಆ್ಯಂಡ್ ತ್ರೀ ಇಯರ್ಸ್ ಆಫ್ ಇಟ್ಸ್ ಎಕ್ಸಿಸ್ಟೆನ್ಸ್ state bank of mysore india is one of the ancient cultured land in the world and karnataka our beloved kannada nadu is a bright gem in the crown of india mysore is the cultural capital of this vibrant land mysore or mysuru the very name conjures up images of exquisite objects such as mysore jasmine with its inimitable fragrance the lingering scent of mysore sandal sole the sheen of mysore silk the majesty of the mysore palace the delicious mysore park the grandeur of mysore dasara and the services of namma bank mysore bank the list can go on and on bank of mysore limited as it was known when this bank began 103 years ago in october 1913 was the brain child of two great visionaries maharaja krishna raja wadayar and sir moksha gundam vishveshwaraya true to their vision what a remarkable contribution this bank has made to the banking industry of karnataka over its 103 years of existence An idea to establish a bank was conceived at the first Mysore Economic Conference in the year 1911 by the then Maharaja of Mysore Rajasri Nalwadi Krishna Raja Wadiyar Bahadur and Bharat Ratna Sir Moksha Gundam Vishveshwaraya a great statesman at the second Mysore Economic Conference held at Mysore in the year 1912 It was decided to establish a bank on the recommendation of the banking committee headed by Sir M Vishveshwaraya Divan of Mysore. Bank commenced its operation with rupees 20 lakhs as capital patronized by the royal family of Mysore on 2nd October 1913 a pious day during Dasara. The Bank of Mysore Limited was established which was a milestone in the banking history of the state. A strategic location at the confluence of six major roads was selected on Avenue Road for bank building which later developed as the central business district of bustling Bangalore. Nandi the sacred bull of the temple of Sri Chamundeshwari the goddess of Mysore was chosen as the bank's emblem In 1923 Mysore Bank acquired an iconic stone building at a princely cost of rupees 2.25 lakhs This housed the bank's prestigious head office. Even today, this stone building is a well-known landmark of Bangalore. The first chairman of the Bank of Mysore Limited was Rajya Sabha Bhushana, Sir K. P. Puttana Chetty, 1913-1938. He set a great precedence for other illustrious leaders who followed. His immediate successor was another renowned personage Loka Seva Sakta Rao Bahadur BK Garudachar In 
the year 1938, Mysore Bank celebrated its Silver Jubilee, and a souvenir was brought out to commemorate the occasion. By 1938, bank expanded its network across the princely state of Mysore, Chintamani, Davanagere, Bangalore Fort, Hassan, Arsikere, Mysore, Chikmagalur, Chikbalapur, K R Nagar, Sakleshpur, Channapatna, Chitradurga, Kolar, Urgam, Sagar, Shimoga, Tiptur, Tumkur. and bangalore recorded tremendous economic growth in 1943 mysore bank opened its first branch outside mysore province the madras branch the branch was inaugurated in the august presence of his highness shri jay chamaraja vudiyar maharaja of mysore and shri chakravarti rajagopalachari popularly known as raja ji in 1944 the authorized capital of the bank was raised to 1 crore rupees in the year 1953 reserve bank of india recognized the services of the mysore bank and appointed it as an agent to conduct government business and treasury operations In 1959, Mysore Bank was the first bank to formulate a special economic policy for the welfare of coffee growers, coffee traders and curers. Bank guided and mentored them throughout the coffee plantation in the region. 1914 when the Bank of Mysore Limited the f- first branch was opened in chikmagalur town mainly for the benefit of the coffee grower at the same time first world war had started and the movement of coffee outside india had become very difficult and the planters were facing financial problem and the bank of mysore limited was the first bank in uh, in karnataka so to say came forward to help the coffee planters and from hence they have been with the coffee planters and have helped them in all their difficulties and also they have guided them how to get along with the plantation as seven notes come together to form a melodious tune seven princely banks came together under the state bank of india as associates The year 1960 marks a crucial transition in the history of Mysore Bank. Under the State Bank of India Subsidiary Banks Act of 1959, Mysore Bank became a subsidiary of State Bank of India and came to be known as State Bank of Mysore. As per the saying of the father of nation Mahatma Gandhi ji that the real India lies in our villages. The bank opened its first rural branch at Anandapuram in Shimoga district. SBM bank in bage MA ide. Namige olle sahaya martta idare. Krushi sala kodtare. Aamele mortgage gold loan kodtare. Mortgage loan kodtare. Pump set gelige loan kodtare. Bele sala kodtare. Tractor sala gulu kodtare. In 1969, State Bank of Mysore was designated as the lead bank in the districts of Mandya and Tumkur. At present, Mysore Bank is the lead bank in Mysore, Tumkur and Chamrajnagar districts. The bank is playing a responsible role in the development of the region. ನಾನು ಶಿವಕುಮಾರ್ ಮೈಸೂರು ಬ್ಯಾಂಕ್ ಪ್ರಾಜಿಸಿದಂತಹ ಮಿಡ್ಸೇಡ್ ತರಬ
ನಾನು ಫೋಟೋಗ್ರಫಿ ಮತ್ತು ವೀಡಿಯೋಗ್ರಫಿ ಬಗ್ಗೆ ತರಬೇತಿಯನ್ನು ಪಡೆದಿದ್ದೇನೆ ಈ ತರಬೇತಿಯ ನಂತರ ನಾನು ಸ್ವಂತ ಸ್ಟುಡಿಯೋ ಮಾಡಿ ಅದರಿಂದ ನಮ್ಮ ಜೀವನ ಸುಖವಾಗಿದೆ ಇದಕ್ಕೆ ಸಹಾಯ ಮಾಡಿದಂತಹ ಮೈಸೂರು ಬ್ಯಾಂಕಿಗೆ ನಾನು ಎಂದಿಗೂ ಚಿರಋಣಿಯಾಗಿದ್ದೇನೆ In 1970, there rose an imposing nine-storied building at a prime location on Kempegowda Road. This was and continues to be the head office of the bank. The building even now towers over the historic Mysore Bank Circle, an association built over the years and firmly instilled in minds of the people of Bangalore. In 1976, State Bank of Mysore sponsored a regional rural bank, the Kaveri Gramina Bank, to aid agricultural growth. Today, this bank is an amalgamation of Kaveri Kalpataru Gramina Bank, Chikmagalur Kodagu Gramina Bank, and Vishweshwaraya Gramina Bank with over 500 branches in the state. With the advent of computerization in the early 1990s, State Bank of Mysore was the first among the associate banks to install a computer mainframe. And in the year 1996, bank's first ATM was installed in the Bangalore branch. The year 2005 saw another feather in the bank's cap. State Bank of Mysore was the first bank to implement core banking solutions in Karnataka without the people behind any institution no organization can achieve greatness state bank of mysore will not be what it is today but for our own people over the years and the people who constitute our customer base this film is a tribute to the people power behind namma bank state bank of mysore Mysore Bank family consists of 10,121 staff members out of which 2,951 are women employees 117 are differently able employees who are relentlessly serving the customers across the nation Bank opened its 400th branch in 1982 500th branch in 1989 600th branch in 2000 700th branch in 2011 780th branch in 2013 in 103 years mysore bank boasts of a network of 1074 branches across the length and breadth of the country bank has fully networked branches with core banking solution equipped with internet banking mobile banking atm green channel counter cash deposit machines self service kiosks etc has made mysore bank a role model bank the mysore bank is a committed and responsible corporate citizen The bank has donated water purifiers to government schools across the country to provide potable water to students. Thousands of schools have been given ceiling fans. Donation of equipment to physically challenged persons has been another notable contribution. Mysore Bank also donated a pediatric ward in Kidwai Cancer Institute, Bengaluru. Whenever natural calamity is stuck, be it the earthquake in Gujarat or floods in Uttarakhand, 
the employees of the bank have risen to the occasion and contributed a day's salary for the welfare of those affected. Mysore Bank's achievement in the field of sports is also commendable. The bank's Kabaddi team has brought home laurels at state, national and international level competitions. It is a matter of great pride that two of our staff are recipients of the coveted Arjuna Award. Srimati Usha Sundarajan for table tennis and Sri B.C. Ramesh for Kabaddi. The bank's cricket team has participated in state-level and national-level tournaments, securing many prizes. Several cricketers have held the bank's flag high. State Bank of Mysore has earned a notable name in cultural events as well. The bank's talented cultural troupe has brought name and fame to the bank winning numerous awards at state and national level drama and music competitions. In the year 1985, Bank promoted Rural Publicity Scheme. With over 50 cultural shows, Mysore Bank has emphasized on the need of banking in the rural masses. State Bank of Mysore was awarded the Best SME Bank Award for financial year 2006-07. Other achievements and accolades include Best MIS Bank Award during 2012-13 for financial inclusion. Best Bank Award under the Tech Savvy category in 2014. The National Award for Excellence in Customer Service during 2014 by BCSBI to mention a few of the notable ones. When we recall the glorious history and legacy of State Bank of Mysore, one of the glittering chapters in that would be the bank's role in development of small-scale industries and small business in the state of Karnataka. The, one of the milestones was the establishment of consultancy cell in 1976. What was called the technical consultancy cell had professionals, engineers, chartered accountants, MBAs and drawn from the officers of the bank. They were trained by the external consultants and these officers in turn trained many others. So they used to conduct training programs internally and they also used to give consultancy to the small units who could not afford professional consultants. So this was a service to the industry. And also we developed entrepreneurship by conducting EDPs and management development programs. So we developed an ecosystem which could make the growth of SIB, as you used to call it, within the bank. State Bank of Mysore has always been known for good customer service and a friendly customer service. So this has been our bedrock so that the people feel at home at our offices. That is why the customers of State Bank of Mysore always call us as Dhamma Bank Mysore Bank. Probably this inspiration came from our founder, Sir Envy himself, who said, to give a good service, you will have to add something which cannot be bought or which cannot be measured with money. We are proud to be associated with uh, a century-old uh, SBM, has been our uh, prime bank for uh, last few years. We started our journey in 1984, taking 20,000 cash credit limit from State Bank of Mysore with nine machines. Today, I am running a factory with 600 machines, contains of six companies, eight outlets, and I have given employment almost for 1,000 people. To reach your State Bank of Mysore have helped me a lot, and thank you so much, State Bank of Mysore. My bank. My bank. Number bank. My bank. Number bank. Number bank. Number bank. 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 Mysore 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 Bank. The year 2013 was the centenary year of State Bank of Mysore. 
completing 100 years of meritorious banking service. The celebration was inaugurated by the then governor of Karnataka, Sri Hansraj Bhardwaj. Massive walkathon was held, which had huge participation of not only staff, but the bank's customers, well wishers, and the citizenry. The bank opened its thousandth branch, which was inaugurated by Sri Sidramaya, the Chief Minister of Karnataka, by Telelink. Yet another celebratory event during this milestone year was reaching a business turnover of 1 lakh crore rupees. At State Bank of Mysore Staff College, Jakur, a memorial lecture series on His Highness Nalwadi Krishnaraja Vodeyar was inaugurated by Sri S.S. Mundra, Deputy Governor of RBI. As an ideal finale, 101 branches of the bank were inaugurated simultaneously by the then Honorable Union Finance Minister, Sri P. Chidambaram. Thankfulness may consist merely of words. Gratitude is shown in acts. The Mysore Bank has immortalized the memories of the founders. Nalwari Krishnaraja Vodiyar and Sir M. Vishveshwaraya by unveiling their bursts on the premises of the bank's head office. To commemorate the 103 years of glorious existence and service of State Bank of Mysore, Department of Post, Government of India released My Stamp. This was a matter of pride for every My Banker. Mysore Bank Heritage Point, a museum in Bangalore branch premises that records the inception, journey, achievements and traditions of our beloved bank. As we move into the fold of State Bank of India, let us carry with us the rich tradition of customer focus which we have built over the years. I wish everyone all the very best in this transition. Memories are part of life. Let the sweet memories cherish in the heart of all who love and adore Mysore Bank for years and years to come. <laughs>